Well, it wouldn't be a complete episode of Money TV without a visit from Briggs Eckleberry. He's a sultan of water. He's also the CEO of Origin Clear, OCLN's their stock symbol. Welcome back. Well, I've dropped in from our water palace downtown. There you go. <laughs> Well, you've always got such great information, such breaking news. I understand you got a piece of breaking news for us this week. Well, absolutely. First of all, I wanted to say that we are moving quickly to integrate the vast Origin Clear empire. Okay. Because, as you know, we've been accumulating different strategic business units. Mm -hmm. And then we realized now, wait a minute, our U.S. units could be benefiting from Origin Clear Hong Kong, which has yes. amazing buying capabilities in China. And so we decided to pull it all together, build an operations hub right here in LA for all of the units yes. and kind of create a hub and spoke system. Okay. And it's being run by Tom Marchesello, who you met a right. few, few, weeks, few ago. weeks ago. And he's becoming key to all this. More to follow. It's kind of interesting because you, you, you kind of consolidate all your, all your uh, eggs in one basket, so to speak. Yeah, because we, you know, you can only run disintegrated for so long, right? <laughs> it, it's good for scaling because nobody has to worry about coordinating. But then, wait a minute, this guy's paying way 20% too much for components, and this guy's got the right price. Our India partner has got great labor rates, for example. Right. right? So we're bringing it all together. But this is not why I'm here today. <laughs> of course not. <laughs> there is a, a proposal by our new governor, Gavin Newsom, to tax the drinking water. Oh, boy. Legitimate problem. There's communities in California, right. uh, in the Mojave, and the Imperial Valley that have very bad water, very poorly served, mm -hmm. and they need help, right? But this, the idea of constantly solving things with big central systems, lots more tax money, bonds, and so forth, it's passe. It's passe. It's old school. I'm going to give you the exact example. Right now in California, because the water rates are so high, you can build this 200-door housing subdivision, put a self-treatment system on, in, the, in the subdivision, water the lawns and the golf course with that, your own water, mm -hmm. and pay for that whole half million dollar system in a year. Mm -hmm. In other words, the water rates themselves are the engine right. for solving the problem, right? Let the water rates do their job. Now, what government needs to do is encourage this self-help model and all I need is, is get a little bit behind it, like what they're, we sh they should be doing in Florida right now. Instead mm -hmm. of spending $8 billion to connect sewage to every single house, just let them have their own system. And I tend to know this company, Modular Water, that can maybe solve this problem. You know, we, 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 could, we could have an idea or two exactly. <laughs> it's exactly what we're doing. Well, you know, government never, um, they never, they always find need for the money they get. They don't tax on the money they need. And it's, it's just kind of a... A never-ending story with the government. They figure, well, we'll just put a tax on something that'll pay for everything. But the money always seems to get spent elsewhere. Right. And they also tend to focus on yesterday's business model. Right. Look at the high-speed train. Well, we already know there's not going to be a high-speed train. We're going to have the self-driving car. Exactly. But government is like, whoa, 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 whoa. You know, they're like, too much. But that's okay because we're here to help. Well, I've been living in California for 35 years. They were talking about high-speed rail back then. I know. And, I mean, billions have been, millions and billions have been spent on this kind of a study and this kind of a study. Yeah. And now they just finally said, we can't do it. But we can do water. We can do water. So what's, um, what can you do to implement you, what your business model into the governor's office, so to speak? So what we're saying and what we're pushing here um, is, is, look, let's... Let, if the government just lets business do its thing, oh boy. right, that is the key. There can be programs that simply encourage this kind of, kind of thing to occur, and they'll be cheap or free, right, mm -hmm. because let the water rates do the job. The water rates are there. Well, see, maybe we're going about this the wrong way. Maybe you can show them how they can use modular water and figure out a way to tax it. And <laughs> then, then they'll be receptive to the idea. Thank you for that. I will take that under <laughs> advisement. But seriously... We have the right technology. It's the, it's the trend. It's how it's going to go. So I'm not going to say don't take care of these communities. Right. We've got to do it. Do it. No question. But at the same time, let's remember that we've got the right structure, which is these incredibly penalizing water rates, mm -hmm. where a brewery that, could spend, that now spends $200,000 a year on water could spend $20,000. Wow. That's the model. That is the model. And we got it. You're truly uh, disrupting the water industry, Riggs. It's really something to watch. Once again, Origin Clear, OCLN is their stock symbol. Check this company out. Uh, they're really, as I said, disrupting the water industry. And this is the guy that's doing it. Thanks so much. Thank you, sir.